the world's population is growing. By 2050, it is projected that there will be 9.15 billion people on the planet. With a growing population comes a growing need for a steady supply of food. This means increased food production and higher crop yields, which depends on healthy, nutrient-rich soil for crops to grow. Traditionally, farmers would plough their fields in a bid to control weeds, but with 20% of Europe's total land area estimated to be affected by water and wind erosion, natural soil formation is a very slow process. Repeated ploughing of topsoil exposes it to erosion and accelerates its degradation processes. Today, using herbicides like glyphosate, farmers can conserve the quality of soil by controlling a wide variety of weeds and their root systems. This reduces the need for soil to be ploughed, increasing farm efficiency and improving crop yields. Conservation tillage practices also allow farmers to plant crop seeds directly into stubble fields and can boost earthworm populations by as much as 50%. This leads to healthier topsoil, the upper layer of the soil, which has the highest concentration of organic matter and microorganisms. It is less prone to erosion from wind and rain and protected from degradation. It also improves soil biodiversity as the organic matter is no longer diluted or churned up. By ploughing less frequently, it means the subsoil, the lower layer of soil, is no longer compacted by the weight of farm machinery, improving water drainage. It also reduces the footprint of agriculture on ecosystems, with fewer greenhouse gas emissions and reduced energy consumption. Maintaining healthy topsoil is crucial to agricultural production. Glyphosate is an important part of the toolkit that allows farmers to practice methods that support their soil's health and biodiversity.